RR Kabul, but Orchid Pharma is also in focus. Ekta is here to tell us why to watch that one. Ekta. Thanks for that. Well, uh, it is important news which is coming for Orchid. In fact, it was one of the triggers for the company, according to analysts who were looking at it quite closely. It is an antibiotic, which is basically a primary novel invention by the company, which has now received European Medicines Agency approval. So that means the European regulator's approval. Now, this particular antibiotic is expected to treat complicatory, uh, complicated un uh, urinary tract infections, pneumonia, and other kind of bacteria. Now, uh, why exactly is the stock higher is because it marks the first instance of an Indian invented drug to reach this stage of clinical development. And hence, you're seeing this kind of double digit gain coming in for Orchid. Now, the other thing is that there is antimicrobial resistance which is taking place, which is basically resistance to antibiotics. And within that context, uh, you are seeing development by companies such as Orchid within the antibiotic space getting approval in a space which requires new drugs to come through. And hence, the antibiotic market for new antibiotics is actually surging. Now, I uh, just want to point out that the estimated annual global sales could be around 200 to 300 million dollars per annum on a 10-year average basis, according to analysts. And Orchid had, in fact, um, outlicensed this drug to a particular company, Alecra, so they will be receiving royalty sales from this particular drug is what I understand. And it could range anywhere between 6 to 8% on worldwide sales. So nonetheless, it's a big uh, development simply because they have received approval for an antibiotic, which is a primary novel invention, and within a market which needs new drugs, which is within the entire antibiotic segment. And uh, hence, the opportunity seems to be large. But uh, <clears throat> Ikta, thanks very much uh, for that.